Your heart is an amazing organ. It is the center of the cardiovascular system and it works twice as hard as the leg muscles of the sprinters by beating over 100,000 times a day and pumping 2,000 gallons of blood to your entire body. Of course, this takes a toll over time. Your arteries that help circulate blood and nutrients to your heart can become thicker and less pliable. This process is called atherosclerosis and it is the leading cause of cardiovascular disease. In traditional medicine, atherosclerosis and cardiovascular disease management takes a black and white approach treating risk factors in isolation and using drug therapies to control them such as a statin for cholesterol or insulin for blood glucose. The functional medicine approach is different in that it looks at the intricate link between each lab value and lifestyle behaviors and patient history to understand their connection and find the root cause and often that begins with chronic inflammation. Inflammation is a normal process and part of your immune system as a response to the damage such as a sprained ankle, your immune system responds to triggers by triggering acute inflammation. But in case of cardiovascular disease, inflammation is chronic and won't carry any noticeable signs like pain, redness or swelling. Unlike Traditional medicine, our cardiometabolic solutions program is designed to attack the underlying causes of atherosclerosis and put patient in charge of their cardiovascular risk by using lifestyle behavioral medicine, using alternating factors like reducing stress which is physical, eating healthy food which is high quality nutritious food, avoiding harmful environmental factors and exercising daily. Daily triggers and challenges from environments such as family, finances, job, work, maladaptation can cause increased inflammation and also maladaptation to lifestyle that typically make this because of poor food choices like smoking, being physically inactive, excessive alcohol intake. In these situations, it is important to be conscious of lifestyle choices that we make as well as practicing proper adaptation to stress and daily challenges such as walking, relaxation and deep breathing exercises. Diets high in processed refined carbohydrates, fried foods and high sugar foods can lead to a condition referred to as insulin resistance. Insulin resistance is when the cells fail to respond to insulin and won't allow it to bind. This resistance leads to elevations in blood sugar, abdominal obesity, sugar cravings, fatigue and chronic inflammation. It is important to eat the whole food that includes a wide variety of colorful fruits and vegetables, healthy fats from nuts, seeds and olive oil and proteins such as cold fish, chicken and legumes and grass fed meat which are also rich in anti-inflammatory omega-3 fatty acids. Avoid harmful environmental factors. There are three primary forms of toxins. Environmental toxins such as pollution, internal toxins such as harmful metabolic byproducts and lifestyle toxins such as cosmetics. When toxins are not processed properly, they are trapped into the fatty tissues of our body and this can lead to weight gain, hormonal imbalances, insulin resistance and chronic inflammation. It is critical to consume nutrients that help with detoxification, avoid cosmetics with harmful chemicals, Choose organic foods when possible, sweat regularly through exercise and drink plenty of water, typically half your body weight in ounces daily. Finally, it is also important to get regular physical activity and daily exercise because being sedentary will lead to insulin resistance and chronic inflammation. First be physically active and make sure you are moving as much as possible throughout the day. Practice healthy habits such as taking the stairs going on frequent walks or using standing desk while at work. Second, make sure you exercise daily for at least 20 minutes at a heart rate above your level with activities such as jogging, sprinting, biking, rowing, swimming, hiking or even intense weightlifting. They are all great ways to exercise. Physical activity and exercise each have a variety of health benefits such as controlling blood sugar, anti-inflammatory benefits, increasing energy, controlling weight and they should be done each day to maximize overall health. Your heart is an amazing organ and pumps oxygen, nutrients and blood to your entire body. Understanding how to take care of your heart and making healthy lifestyle choices will help you revitalize your health, take control of your cardiovascular risk and optimize wellness. 
call Kota Metabolic Institute about the cardio metabolic solutions because it's time to take care of your heart. This is Dr. Kota with Kota Metabolic Institute.